Hey, what's up everybody working from home or considering working from home or remotely, AWOL here. Like you, I've been working from home actually for the last 10 years. And over the last 10 years, I have tried every freaking piece of equipment you can use in a home studio. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about the two best USB mics that are out there uh, for working from home. It's the Blue Yeti USB mic, this guy, and the Samson G-Track Pro, this guy. I have used both of these mics for years. This one I actually started about 10 years ago working from home with it. And since then, I have tripled my work from home income using this mic on calls uh, to talk to clients, to talk to bosses, and to get my ideas across in calls. And let me tell you, the value of having a great mic and a great camera, I'll do a video on cameras later, when you're working remotely is massive. People listen to your ideas. When you speak up, you just boom over everyone else that's using a phone. And you, they sound like hot garbage when they're talking on their phone. They can't be heard. So if you purchase one of these two microphones, you will be heard. You will sound way better than everyone else you're competing with for online jobs or who's in your company. And these both cost about 120 to 130 US dollars right now. Cool? Let's go over the features of the mics. And then I'm just going to do a side-by-side side recording comparison, and you can decide which one sounds better. Link in the description below to both of these, as well as all the accessories that come with the mics if you want them. For example, these stands come with both of the mics, so you can put it on your desk, etc. Okay, so the first one is the Samson G-Track Pro. So this microphone is super simple to use. It comes with a USB cable, and you plug that USB cable directly into your computer, and it just instantly works. No setup, really. Here are the cool features that make this easy to use when you're using it to work from home. So number one, it's got a mute button on the front. So if you say something on a call, you go click. You say some, whatever you want to say on your call, click. It's muted and you're no longer heard, which is great. It's got a couple different modes. For you, you're going to want to use cardioid mode, which means that you can speak directly into the front of the microphone and it'll only pick that up. But if for some reason you had someone else in your space, it's got figure eight where it'll pick up from the front and the back, and it's also got Omni mode, uh, where you can capture the entire room's worth of audio if you needed to. That's really sick. That knob is right there on the front of the microphone for that. You can turn your mic volume up and down with this handy knob here. It's got an instrument input. I don't know, you guys aren't here because you're playing the guitar, but it's got that. And it's also got a volume knob right on the front, a physical volume knob, so that you can adjust the headphone volume. So you can plug your headphones directly into the back of this mic, which is great. So you can pop those headphones on while you're on the call. You can hear yourself talking into the mic and you can hear what everyone else is saying on the call all in one unit. You don't have to use your headphone jack or anything else in your computer. It's all right here in the mic, which is sick. And if you don't wanna hear yourself, you can just turn yourself off with the monitor knob in the back. This mic is freaking great. You're gonna hear it in the recording check in just a minute. It's built like a freaking ton of bricks. It's so heavy. It's like almost a couple pounds here of worth of mic. If you drop this thing, it is not going to break, okay? So the Blue Yeti USB mic is one that is near and dear to my heart. That's the other one I recommend. This is literally the original one I've been using for close to 10 years that I started my career as a creator and a remote consultant and everything with and it's got very similar features. This is the industry standard, the one that everyone is trying to copy. Like this mic, the one I just told you about, is copying this one. This is the OG version. Same features, just a little bit more limited. Mute button on the front. There's a volume knob where you can adjust what you hear on the calls you're on when you're working remotely from home. And on the back, as you can see, there's only two knobs here to keep it simple. Gain is to control the volume on the mic. And then it's got all the different microphone modes on the back I told you about. You can go figure eight, you can do omni, and you're probably just gonna wanna do cardioid uh, on the back here, which is the one I have right now, which looks like an upside down heart. Both of these microphones are a front address microphone. So you're gonna wanna point them at yourself like this. A lot of people try to use these microphones like this. That is not going to work, okay? You have to talk directly into the front of the mic like that in order for it to pick you up properly, okay? So let's go ahead and mount this up here in my studio, and then I'm going to let you just hear for yourself and determine which ones you like the sound of better. What do you wanna sound like? Stay tuned. 
This is the unfiltered audio from the blue Yeti USB mic. I'm hang 10 distance from the front of the mic and it's stripped down of all of its parts, including the stand that comes with it. Also, I'll include in the description below the windscreen that you can put over the cover of the mic to help get rid of pops on the mic, but I didn't put that there today because I want you to hear the mic in exactly the way it sounds, hang 10 away from your mouth. It is in cardioid mode. I'm trying to make the volume level very similar to what you're about to hear from the Samson G-Track Pro. I'll also include in the description a stand like this if you don't want a desktop stand and you want a boom arm stand for your Blue Yeti USB mic and you want a shock mount to prevent the banging on your desk from getting through to the mic, link in the description below to that. This is the Blue Yeti USB mic. Check one, two, three, four, five, six. My name is Andrew Wall, link in the description below. This is the Samson G-Track Pro USB mic. I'm hang 10 distance away from the mic and it's on cardioid mode just like the Blue Yeti was. I tried to line up the volume levels to be exactly the same as the Blue Yeti was. There are no filters, no enhancements, no post-processing at all. It's in mono mode. The gain is right at 12 o'clock. This is the way this microphone sounds. Now I've got this one on its stand that it comes with because I still have the stand for this one, the Blue Yeti USB mic stand. I lost it like five years ago or something when I moved. This is the Samson G-Track Pro. This is the way this microphone sounds when you're close to the microphone, about hang 10 distance away, talking directly into the front of it, which is the way you're supposed to use both of these microphones. Thank you so much for watching, and if you found this video valuable at all, Work From Home Warriors, give it a thumbs up right now. That highly motivates me to continue to make these videos in my free time. Adios amigos, and best of luck with your remote work and your work from home chapter of your career.